Now we're checking out The First Men, TFM, The First Men, uh, developed and published by Gathering Tree, coming out later this spring, so probably next month or... Well, I guess it could come out in March, April, or May. Uh, spring is, you know, three seasons, of course, so we'll see. Uh, we're going to go check it out. Let's see how we like The First Men. If it loads, eventually. There we go. There we go. Let's see, where are we? Steam Next Demo, this is a pre-alpha demo build. Prior to our early access release, we want to join this multi-death celebration of upcoming games on Steam. As we incorporate your feedback and continue the development, please expect the features frequently added or reworked, and don't be alarmed by, is by any disembodied voices, teleporting objects, or paralyzed characters. Okay, sounds, um, that's fine, right? That's fine. Don't roast the poor otter, friendly. So rude. Also, hello, Seizure and Sakoon. How are you doing today? All right. Mods. Not available in the demo. Okay, it's going to be mods. It's going to be multiplayer. Skirmish. Hmm. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Edge scroll speed zero. I, I appreciate... Why would you make music so quiet, though? Why would you make music so quiet? <laughs> I'm mostly most of a person that puts like SFX and UI down. But why would you make music so quiet? <laughs> oh well, whatever, it's fine. Uh, and that is it. I, I swear, I only clicked options again. I swear that's the only thing I did. I swear that's the only thing I did. I don't know what language I have evo evoked here, but I, I swear I only clicked options again. I didn't mean to break it. I don't know why there's two numbers now for certain things. I don't know what I've done. I did a thing. FG Breaker of Games. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 How did I break it already? I already clicked on options. I swear. Hi Void Time. Hi Kitty Licious. Good to see you. <laughs> How's it going? Good to see you. Hello, hello. I didn't do I swear I didn't do anything. I swear. Okay, campaign. There's four maps where we can only play one. Can't edit anything or anything like that, but that's okay too. And that's okay. But I swear, I literally only pressed a button once. You haven't slept yet. FT's in a great break. Dude, I touch. I touch a game and it it I, I find something. I I am I am so terrible at breaking games. It just happens. I don't even I'm not even trying, that's the thing. Like I'm not even trying and stuff breaks. That's just how it is. All right, let's start Demoria. Oh lordy. Blind Prince Yarvram sent his ill-forgotten test subjects he called humans to Demoria, a pocket prison dimension that he created long ago. He sent them through a way gate and gave 40 years to kill one of the shard holders of his imprisoned dragon mother, Svetlana. Shard holders are faction leaders who have scattered around Demoria and they're performing a ritual to break her chains. Didn't we just talk about breaking chains and games and all the things? <laughs> okay. Uh, can I, you send me some games? You need some breaking down on them. I, I very much, I can do that very well. Mm -hmm. If these humans fail to kill at least one of the shard holders, your dream will have to destroy the Moria with everything inside it. As a precautionary measure, if they succeed, this pocket realm will be their new prison as a reward. Certainly better than the abyssal cells made of devil bones. Uh, you wish to add a demo category? Yeah, that would be cool. You can also just search for demo and then it lists all the demos. That's what I do. Uh, but it would be really useful, yeah. Your dream has very little hope and it's up to you to prove him wrong and save the lives of these humans by getting rid of one of the shard holders before his patience run out. Begin. Okay. Ah! 
Huh. Oh. Okay, that's the thing. Objectives and rules. Kill one of Svetlana's shopkeepers before year 40. Claw mother Ki uh, uh, Keisha of Keisha's ba bears. Saint Lord Jamal in the breach. Gorthok the betrayer in Bedrock Hills. Or Frost Runner Bella in the Eerie. Okay, sure. All right, quick tutorial. <laughs> okay, um. <laughs> the, the, the text disappears off screen, but hey, that works, whatever. All right, cool. Uh, I think we're currently paused. There's a lot of mushrooms. Uh, I think Apollyon would approve. Also, a lot of saturation, yes. Also. You unbreak it by clicking it again. I don't know how I don't know how I did that, but I did it somehow. All right. See, I only click this. Yeah, you only click options, and then then like more numbers appear somehow. <laughs> oh lordy! All right, these are all named tests. Oh god, that scrolling speed. Okay, wait. Ten. Uh, uh, 10 is a bit too fast. Let's go to uh, 7. Yeah, that's better. Pause, though. Test subjects. If you at maximum zoom distance, it feels blurry. Like, here it's fine, but if you zoomed in all the way, it feels blurry. Is that just me? I don't have any options though, so okay, we'll just deal with that. I also don't like that it ultimately unpauses you if you get out of the menu. Oh, Jesus Christ, that's a lot of information that's just dumped at you. Um, can I rename you? I can, okay, cool. Wait one second, let's open the queue, you go. Exclamation mark join! Twitch please has nothing to do with Twitch mark. I need to open the queue for you to be able to enter the, uh, the queue. It's not on Twitch's end. That's just me. Meow. Meow. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There you go. All right, we'll just let everybody join on in, and then we'll go. Mm-hmm. There we go. And then we'll name our experiment test job subjects. Mm-hmm. my internet no don't lick my internet please it was being wonky the other day please don't lick it i need it to be not wonky don't lick it all right we have five test jobs like subjects to name let's do two three one two three Meow. yeah i know all right this is voidheim this is monia aka test subject 69 cool 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 of course she denied and then this is mastani mastani is in as well and then two more nice yeah hey citrus mints good to see you hello hello All right two more one two no no cat stop is that a cat in the middle i do believe so yes all right b hex oops there we go and we've got Dreadwing, aka Testbird. Sure. Okay, cool. And then, is that that's the cats? Can I rename the cats? No, I cannot rename the cat. The cat we're just named PC. Mhm. Mm 
can't, I can't do that. It looks like it has a blueberry for an eye. It does, doesn't it? <laughs> okay, middle mouse button. Characters per... Okay, what the heck is this? Characters. Why is it, like, lit up like that? Okay. Possessions. Relations. Precious cat, panda cat, I missed one. No, I did not. No, 69 is Monia. <laughs> hey, rogue twitching. Traditions. Oh. Most of them don't seem to be available. I... So I appreciate the art style. Like, I, I love, like, the art style looks almost a little bit like... Um, like, don't staff, don't staff togethery, like, you know, that sort of stuff. Like, I love the design of the mushrooms and the trees. But there's a lot of stuff, that there's a, there's like, this visually, there's a lot going on. And, and these panels, because they're supposed to, they, they show you what they, what, like, these are related, like, the, the pictures are related to what they do, right? It's a bit too small? It's a bit too small? Oh, I know, I know Lord Mimia, but I'm just looking at the UI in general in the game. Oh yeah, I will, I will, I will. I, of course I will, but I'm just looking at the, the game and the tutorial over, like the game overall. Just giving my impression so far. Yeah, yeah, the tutorial. All right, learn. Learn to play. W A S D. Yeah, middle mouse button. Zoom in. Yeah, pause time. Gotcha. You can also speed up. Yep. Q and E. Okay. You can do boxing. All right. Uh, the first one is a strategy game, and, ha uh, and as all of them has fog of war, your characters reveal the fog, fog around the world. Got it. Points. Prosperity, industry, influence, unity, amenity. Characters collect points which are affected by doing work time activities. There are five entity points. Operations you call Operations call you to action when someone requires your attention and keep an eye on them. I guess when it's like that. Oh, okay, so this has character possessions, which I have to do okay. Alright, sure, yeah. Hi Belle! Good to see you! Hi! Thanks for stopping by. How's it going? How's the trip? So much snow, dude. I'm so jealous. Uh, you can unlock your tradition whenever you have enough unity points. They're locked. Available. Unlocked. Unity points. Got it. Okay, cool, cool, cool. F4 key lets you open the traditions panel. Got it. You can unlock new bragging rights whenever you have enough immunity points. Bragging rights. Okay, what do they do? I have none. Okay, so I can't even check them out. They're still on the train. Oh, I see. Choo choo. Sorry. <clears throat> uh, characters. You can select the character. F1 character panel. Each character is unique <coughs> with different stats and traits. You can observe them. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Doing work costs them energies. To replenish, your characters have to do downtime activities. Characters collect path points and reveal several outcomes for you to choose a reward. F gets you open the path outcomes of the chosen character if they have 100 path points. This is information dump. All right. You can navigate between outcome tabs by clicking the colors. Each color tab that contains different outcomes. You progress your settlement by choosing paths for your characters. Okay. Possessions. Constructions and doodads are objectives you place on your region. To place an object, you can select it from the panel. See it attached to your mouse cursor. And then you can place it. You can set crafted items from the panels to your character too. Okay, you can bind items from characters' inventories. Characters will benefit from an item in the skills after binding. Characters automatically use consumables and benefit from the outcome. Okay, wow, this is this is a this is not even, <laughs> I wouldn't even call this like a quick tutorial. This is an let me dump all of this information in your face. That's what this is right now. <laughs> Uh, during your exploration of the world, you can meet other entities. F3 key lets you open the relationships panel. Entities have relations with each other and their characters may have quests. You can follow them here. Keep an eye on dangerous quests. Okay, parties. 
To explore outer regions, you must form a party. To create a new party, you can cliff click in the party button. Adding additional parties requires more population and influence. Simply collect a uh, character. Oh, a, a character to party. Got it. To remove character, right click that character. Okay. Draft a party. Draft button or art key. You can move draft parties around the world simply by kicking. Pressing left click is the band. Okay, this band is R. The parties outside of your settlement borders this band button turns into a camp button. Ah, this is so much stuff. So much information. Holy moly. Also, I want. Double chocolate chip cookie too, Mark. Share. Be nice. Be nice. Meow. Yes. He, be nice, please. Mm-hmm. I know. I know, B Hex. I know. I know. I'm waiting. I'm waiting as well for it. Panda does not get any cookies because he's a kitty cat. You gain a lose reputation with other entities you have met. Hostile characters attack you with sight and show uh, are shown with red outlines. Neutral characters are yellow. Friendlies are green. Right clicking, hostile character to move and attack. If you choose to attack, you can do that by right clicking. Use their skills in combat. Okay, yeah, okay. Sure! <laughs> All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. I see. I, I, I think I see. So what is this? So I can move. Can I move you all? No. All right. Cool. Wow. This, this, this game does not tell you anything, does it? Uh, move camera to home. Create new party. Can I only, can I put everybody on the party? No, I cannot. Uh, draft. That doesn't seem to work. Can I mod ban your imposter? No, oh God. Are you out of your mind? How the heck are we supposed to kill the Doomsayers, Shark Keepers in 40 years? Plain room. Speed. What's this? A gateway. When progress oh, okay. We just had a new settlers will arrive. Okay, that's very only. Mm. Yeah, they're all foraging right now. Gathering tree. Sacred tree of the first man across a fool called Yardum's Delight every once in a while. That text is so tiny. Like, holy moly. That text is so tiny. Everybody's just off explore. Okay, bye. <laughs> what am I even doing? Okay, that's that. I don't have any possessions. I feel like I should, like, build something. But there's nothing I can do. Everybody's just gathering things. Okay, apparently I can I can do a path thing for you. You can have it between tabs, but I can use one path. Wild path. You can become an erudite, self-critical. Eureka. Uh, or you can become kind. Seed rack. I like strawberry field, apple tree, banana tree, potato field, and olive tree. Okay. So you unlock buildable things by scaling that into your characters. Interesting. Hi, A. Cool. Happy Tuesday. How are you? Good to see you. Laborer. They can, the only ones who can grab a hammer and build a construction. Scavenging mount. Scavenged stone. Okay, so... Ha! Huh, interesting. That is such an interesting way of doing it. It's like, so backwards. Like, you don't have a global unlock. People... 
you do it through the people menu. Very interesting. Very, very interesting. Yeah. I'm trying. <laughs> I am. I am. Mm hmm. I am trying. I'm, I'm trying. Mm hmm. Hi, Apoth. Um. Not super obvious right now. And I guess that skills your... Does that? Does this relate to this at all? I guess it must do, right? Bonfire. So your kids are... Oh, okay. Characters can worry about their future by looking at the fire or warm up to get rid of the fail stuff. How does... A very strange way of doing it. So I guess I click it and then you'll learn that. Okay. You can learn something. But they all learn different things. Ha. Huh. Guarding. Makeshift club. Slingshot skills. Trap table. Adds red and fish, bug, bird, Frog traps and trap with passion to path outcomes. They can clean traps to get rid of their fatal souls. Targeting rock, melee training dummy. I. That's a very weird way to do it. You need something to occupy you until the new Battle Brothers DLC. Wait, this is not out yet. We're currently playing the the demo. Um, a path. Yeah, we're currently playing the demo, which is gathering. Seat rack. Let's do the seat rack for you. It's a very interesting way of doing it. I'm not sure if I like it, though. That's mud earth road, scavenging mound, firewood. Sounds important to have. Or sounds good to have, I suppose. And then we could do a shrine. Contemplating, contemplating characters feels progress when it's full of quick, purifying consumer can be crafted through path outcomes. Lore keeping rock. A character transforms it into a quest stone consumable about reaching 100% progress, which then can be used to obtain quests from white trade paths. Sure. <laughs> sure. I don't know what I'm doing, but hey, we're doing it. Whatever that means. Uh, oh, pizza. What kind of pizza did you have, Monia? What kind of pizza have you had? All right, mud bugs. Uh, well, we'll be checking, uh, Apoth, we'll be checking out demos all week. Uh, this is demo number four of the day. Crafted one stack of shrine construction on entity inventory. Oh, okay. Now this pops up here. So we built a shrine. And a seed rack. And, and a bubba bubba bonfire. Okay. Made a melee training dummy. Homemade pizza with salami, mozzarella, corn, anchovies, kidney beans, and zucchini. Pass on the anchovies, yeah. Mm-hmm. You don't know what I'm doing, but I'm doing it anyway. It just sounds like dive in general. Yeah, words. Yes, it does. I have to play the song. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's not copyright protected, Mark. Bubba bubba bonfire. Uh, hi, Inky. We've looked at Ixion, Reefland, Battle Cakes, and now this. Uh, TFM, The First Men. Okay. All right, you've made that. Who was suspicious? Oh, Lord. Um... Gatherer. 
Saint Rack or a risky pregnancy. Something wicked may be about to pop. Life stats of this character may cause the newborn to obtain negative genetic traits. D what? Okay. Um, no, I think we'll just make you a gatherer instead for now. <laughs> um, optimistic sounds good to me. Yeah, sure. Uh, oh, one Belgian seafood. Oh, Monia, so mean today. Yeah, make a makeshift club. Why not? Um, Lord Keeping Rock, Purifier. If we consume the power of shrines and craft the purifying essences, they then used to get rid of unwanted quirks by those who are affected by them. Sure, sounds good. I don't know what I'm doing. And there's not a lot of explanation. This game is not what I expected it to be. But, alright, we'll, we'll try for now. So is this a bad time to talk about the salty caramel brownie on my desk? Yeah, yeah, Vel Fury, it kinda is. It kinda is. Mm-hmm. Thank you so much for 20 months of support, though. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you! So much for keeping up your sub almost two years i really appreciate it thank you your pizza yourself chicken bacon onion mushroom and garlic nice belgian seafood chocolate it's not actual seafood it's just shaped like seafood and it's really good high quality tasty chocolate it's really 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 tasty it is really 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 tasty all right i made a makeshift club uh mastani gets a cr club sure why not a horse that's a terrifying looking horse that head is so big look at it oh lordy <laughs> that's terrifying yeah i same veil fury but they're so nice aren't they and thank you again so much for 20 months they are so nice, yeah. It's, um... I think it's seashells, actually, is what they call it. Um... Yeah, 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 it's seashells. You're not sponsored by Tesco or anything like that, but those ones. And they have, like, nougat, and they have, like, uh, like normal, like, milk chocolate, white chocolate in there, and... Oh, they're so good! They're so nice. The proportions are closer to a hippo than a horse. Yeah. Yeah. All right, test subject 69. Strawberry field. Make a strawberry field. That sounds pretty sensible to me. Um, laborer. Makeshift shelter. Sounds like something we should have. Yeah, I... Oh, okay. Forget what I said about the horse. The cow is cute. Alright? The cow's pretty dang cute. The cow's cute. I love the teeth on the donkey. Did you see the teeth on the donkey? <laughs> the teeth on the donkey. Oh god, there's more cows. Okay. We crafted three f stacks of strawberry field doodads. Well, I assume we could put that down like that. This is very odd. This game is not what I thought it would be. Precautionary. Removes the next fatal body and spends five prosperity. Green apple tree. Sounds good to me. Yeah, Jensaman! Same! <laughs> Potato field. It's somewhat self-playing, I think. Comforter, whenever a settlement member finishes sleeping, this character removes a random fatal trait. I don't know what I'm doing. It's like a role-playing room world with D&D &D fast progression. Yeah, I, I don't know. 
I'm I'm very confused. I'm very confused. I, I don't quite understand what's going on right now. Oh. That crow looks also like something else, chat. That that crow just that that crow what that crow looks um that's unfortunate proportions can i just say that those are some very unfortunate proportions all right makeshift shelter let's say um over there why not green apple trees sure I, I have no idea what I'm doing. The game doesn't really have much of a tutorial at the moment. Okay, I can, I can do cooking. Let's learn how to cook. Okay, I, I think I learned how to cook. Yeah, I, I think I learned how to cook. Gathering, hunting, and then we learn cooking. And I guess then we have... To... It's very... It feels very strange to learn how to do things. Because your dudes level up. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, I am... I am... Yeah, but I think I need to I need to domesticate them once I can once they have filled their path points and then I can click the path points and then they do it. It's very odd so far. And, and I'm I'm not sure if I dig it. I don't think I'm digging this chat. At the moment. It's, it's, for one, the lack of a tutorial, but it's a demo, right? I, I can kind of forgive them to not have a full tutorial in the game. But the whole unlocking things because your dudes are learning thing and then you can place them and people build them. It's very strange. And I'm, I'm not really feeling it. There's a lot of, like, currencies and points, and... You can get bragging rights. Fireborn characters, waterborn characters... I don't even know what that all means. Yeah, you need combat first. Yeah. Almost. I'd say so as well. Hi, Lang. Good to see you. Oh, those are really cute emotes. Oh, I like those. Also, Tespat looks like a zombie. I'm sorry, but you look like a zombie. So I don't know where your other arm is. Because shouldn't the arm be here? I, th I think you're scratching your butt right now. I'm pretty sure you're scratching your butt right now. I'm sorry, but I think that's what's happening. It does, Tomokizu, but it doesn't play like it at all. It also doesn't play like RimWorld. It, I, yeah. I kind of want to see combat and then we might move on. Hi, Robes. Good to see you. Hey, Ratoffel. How are you? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not sure. Also, why do they get like a red name? Is that when they're is there when they're red? Are you ready to do the level up thing again? Yeah. Okay. Cause then then they get this stuff. And I I don't know what that means. And I don't know what it does. 
Like, you've got all of these things, and then you choose a path point for them, and that's only the only time they make a weapon? The horse is strange. Yeah. Hi, Tails. How are you? The horse has a giant head. The funny thing is with the graphics as well, everything is fine in this zoom level, but if you zoom in all the way, it gets blurry. If you zoom in this close, all of the art is blurry. Not the text or anything like that, but all of the art is blurry. Yeah! I mean... Hmm. Hi, Lamoon, good morning, how are you? Not necessarily even slow. Also, is year 40 the number there? Or what is a year? I don't know. This is a, this is a, yeah, no. For me, this right now is a, is a no. I, I don't understand, like from what you can do right now, I don't understand how to play it fully. And what I understand, I'm not enjoying the whole assign things through people's path points and then you can unlock stuff. Having five currency, like five point things to keep an eye on and like locking certain things behind certain path points and then you can unlock them with other path points is confusing. It's very confusing. Very, very confusing. Um, yeah, this gets a pass for me from now. Nope. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. Maybe when it comes out in early access. We'll see. We'll see. 